Hey guys, what's going on? This is Buzzetech here and welcome to Tuesday Tutorials and you're watching part 2 of how to make a free website with free domain. In the last part we had seen up to registering a domain and a hosting. So today we are going to install WordPress on our site so we can efficiently blog with our own customization. So let's have a look. So guys before beginning the tutorial if you haven't watched the first part click on the annotation on the screen or check out the link in description and watch the video and then come back to this video and proceed okay so in the c panel of dot t of dot two free hosting dot com go to the site c panel dot two free hosting dot com over here c panel what c panel is it is a kind of a dashboard which has all your settings for your website which you can handle from the cpanel okay control panel you can call it control panel for your website okay here you have to fill all the details you had filled up when you were signing up for uh, for hosting services at 2freehosting.com okay now click on login when you come to cpanel when you come to the cpanel you have to scroll down okay in the cpanel you will see this category called website and then in the category you will see this auto installer click on auto installer and over here in the auto installer you can easily install wordpress on your site um, and uh, actually there are many options for uh, in the auto installer like for a category called blogs you can you have these kind of scripts which can help you install you which which are scripts which can make your blogging experience very super awesome you know these are all top scripts which are available on the internet when we scroll down in this you are you can see this there are portals or CMS which which are used by uh, many what you can call it many huge sites which have like uh, you know YouTube maybe uh, YouTube dashboard is kind of a CMS I think so yes uh, and we can scroll down you can see e-commerce what it is like amazon.com you know Amazon uh, is based on these scripts and when you come down educational you have this educational stuff uh, forums and then image galleries guest books musics there are many kind of scripts for other stuff like polls and surveys then project management rss social networking customer support and wikis so these are different options you can choose any one of them but in this tutorial we can we are only focusing on installing wordpress so we'll click on wordpress and over here uh, in the install to this field leave this field as it is and in the administrator username you have to fill it uh, whatever username you want but make sure you have secured username for your website okay so for this tutorial I will just make it like I will just quickly fill out the password and after filling the password you have to do is just click on this install WordPress 3.3.1 okay I will meet on I will meet you on the next page so now after you do that just go and open open your new tab and over here type out your website's name with the .tk domain and then click on slash and had a slash and then type this WP admin what WP admin is it is a kind of a uh, dashboard to control to maintain your website okay so over here we have already filled the I have the auto filled over here and I will click on login and over here this is dashboard of a WordPress website so it's super cool and uh, it will be super awesome now if we go now actually it says that WordPress 4.2.2 is available please update now but now you know I'm not going to go deep into the stuffs and update it uh, you can just update it by clicking on this update now and then you will have options so by the way if you go to website and visit website I will just open it in a new tab and we will see our new website open I will just give you a quick overview of some settings in the WordPress so this is how our site looks uh, it's not that well maintained and but we will make it better if in the coming weeks if we get 10 likes to this video I will definitely make a video about customizing WordPress with in just a few minutes okay so now we'll go back to dashboard and now here you can go to settings general 
and over here you cap you have to give your site a title so I will just go and give it a title like Teco Toki and tagline I will just make it and WordPress address should be your name otherwise there will be a major problem with your connecting your website and your site you are just keep it as it is and add an email address for your username uh, in the membership you have to choose if your website is for membership or just for blog I will leave this option as it is and then these are all some journal setting and click on save changes and now for adding a theme you have to go to appearance themes and there are thousands of themes available on the WordPress directories or you can just go to any other uh, external sources and you can download them from there too for free you know so guys we will just leave this tutorial as it is for now okay so that's it we have installed WordPress on our site come go so guys thank you for watching this was my tutorial about how you can this was the final part of how to make a website with free domain and in this part I had shown you on how you can install WordPress on your site with which you can blog efficiently and very quickly and so guys I had to stop this tutorial because I want to give more tutorials in the coming week with a customization of your site so be sure to hang with me up and to stay updated click on the subscribe button how about giving a thumbs up to this video and sharing this video with your friends on Facebook Twitter Google Plus or any other social media and how about commenting down below and giving your honest feedback to me that will be super awesome guys please give a comment down below I would really appreciate that so guys thank you for watching I'll meet you next time bye bye